Hello everyone, Combat Brick Productions here, and today we have my German half track in again, SDKSZ251. Um, this time it's almost finished. Last time, if you go watch the video, it's the couple ones before this. Um, it didn't have any track or wheels, um, and I've also almost I'm starting on the back now. Got to figure out if I've um, figured out a way to put some side panels on if you look in there. Sort of take this off here. Using a flat facing clip and one of these combo run rounds with a pole on it to make this angled shape. It's the back of the SDK Z251. Put this back on here. Now I have added some cool features to this one. So, as you can probably tell, it still fits the five minifigs in very comfortably um, while still being very to scale. Not 100% to scale, but very to scale. Also, as you can see here, the tracks are very working. They I think it's really cool. Just have a tank. Not so much backwards, but forwards. They work really well on both sides. Uh, I'm going to try and get some of these in the right colour. These in um, the light stone grey are pretty hard to come by. Uh, unless you go into Bricklink or something like that. They don't sell them anymore on lego.com. Um, I've also added suspension to the front. <laughs> These wheels. You can see there. I got it. I got it. There we go. As you can see here, it's got a bit of suspension in that front tire on both sides. I just pretty easily designed this. It works like this. It also has turning capabilities. See that turning it doesn't stay like that, but I'm hoping to figure that out in a little bit. Um, you got tracks, which I think is really cool that I was able to get them working very smoothly. Like that. I will be doing a tutorial on this when it's done. Um, I've figured out some different building techniques here. I'm using these, these plates like this, one of those bits, under here to make it more rounded and smooth. Like that. These, these sides just fold in like that, that line there. Yeah, and that's about it for this update. Uh, I don't think I've changed much. I've done a bit of work on the front bonnet to make it a little bit smoother. And it should be done in the next couple of weeks and I'll post a tutorial on it. I uh, hope you guys liked today's video. So I've not been uploading much. Been very busy. Anyway, that's all. I um, hope you guys liked my SDKFZ design. And please subscribe and like. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.